generic greetings and welcome back once again to prison architect in the previous episode we built our sultry confinement for the low risk on the bottom left we added on this uh, contraband throwing in area where we can catch all of that stuff and then punish the prisoners for what purpose i'm still unsure but it seems to be working and we also built the top right cell block for the first of our high risk prisoners and as soon as they turned up there was a bit of a fight in both canteens as well and somehow a there's a massive fire in this canteen and also over here that I managed to miss very, very easily somehow. Let's go over to our <laughs> emergencies and we are bringing in fire engines. We don't have air firefighters because we don't have a helipad, but I'm very tempted to build one. And I really don't know why this is on fire. I have no idea why this is on fire in the first place. Obviously someone has set that, but I mean, what on earth's happened there? There's no traits as far as I can tell that would do that and there's no reason for that to happen as well but anyway our fire engines are coming in and this is a very very big fire and this is going to probably dominate the episode where we'll have to spend a lot of time and indeed money trying to fix this problem and you can see that is sweeping into this uh, power here I'm going to switch off that there because it'll just blow up otherwise and I'm gonna have to fight the fire on multiple fronts now obviously it is burning through a couple of areas. This also requires us to turn it off and turn that off because the water, I said turn off. Why is it not turning off? Oh, there we go. So that's gonna put the entire prison into darkness while we try and fix this. And there we go. And you actually press H as well too, uh, to aim at yourself if you want, but there you go. And we've also got some deaths there. Well, there was actually a guard in there. I really didn't even notice. Um, we've got, like I said, the fire spreading on the bottom left and also in the in the area around here. I think we've got enough firefighters around here to tackle that blaze, so we need to sort this one out. There's no, as far as I can tell, way for the prisoners to escape. There's nothing uh, like that for danger-wise, so that's fine. But we are having some deaths. Wow, over here. So there's some traits of some kind then that are... Oh, I mean, it could be... Increase this free time at least six hours a day. It could be that. It could be that. Um, I mean, that is a possibility. But, obviously, with all of the contraband scanners offline and things like that, we have a problem there. Right, we will turn that off, uh, get rid of those firefighters, and now we'll have to rebuild the thing. We can, obviously, turn on the power now. On, on, and on. But a lot of this won't even be connected to the grid. So if we check, oh yeah, if we check this we can see there's a lot of things that are broke. So let's get all of the power in sooner rather than later. That should be that connected up. You can see there's been some damage there. It says, yeah, give prisoners more free time. We've only got an hour and a half to finish that. So I'm guessing it is that that's caused this because there'd be no other reason for the fire to, to be started there. And that is going to finish. Three, two, one, and done. Prisoners have settled down and stopped causing trouble over their lack of free time. Maybe they realise they have less. Uh, maybe they realise they'd have even less if they are always in solitary. Yeah, maybe maybe they thought that, and maybe they decided to start burning everything down. Okay, so let us continue on with the rebuilding of the facility, mainly obviously in the canteen there. And I'll see in this, I mean, that is a disaster of a cell. There's nothing left of it, half of these ones. So that goes down there and along there. That section needs to be put in. All of this needs to be rebuilt along there, little sections there. And then we'll continue on later. In terms of the amount of prisons that we have, 109 at the moment, 118 being the maximum, including our protective custody. 16 maximum security prisoners we have at the moment, and we can see that there is water everywhere because they've been damaging this, and it does say no canteens accessible, so yeah, we had a problem with that as well. It does seem that having that as the custom sector um, really just, does it not work, or is it this to do with the staff only nature of this? Let me check. Oh! Because of the entrance way, of course. It's these bits. I think that's what it is. Custom sector. That should fix it. There you go. Fixed it. It's because of the entrance way. So we can still have that as medium sex. So the medium prisoners can work there. But this one here is uh, now set up correctly. 
All right, so I'm going to actually hire some more workers. Four more workers, because there's lots of stuff to finish and build. Yeah, it was just these little extra sections. Very easy to miss. Um, obviously, this is all saying canteen. It's because it does need to be extended like so. And then there as well. And that should be it all in. Looks to be the case, yes. Over to our flooring. And there's that now placed. And also for pipe work. There's been piping, pipe work missing from a lot of this. Because, I don't know if you noticed, but it sort of burnt a bit. Even the pipes full of water didn't uh, manage to stop it. Is that saying it's enclosed? It's not enclosed. So there's probably a section that I have missed. Over two wall sections then. Yeah, there was a section that I missed there. So, cell, 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 and flooring. And that should be, I believe, the majority of that fixed. Yeah, I think so. Oh, no, there's a little section of wall that we haven't. Right. Kennel. Just double check to make sure that is... Yep, it is all set up. That's fine. Obviously, we did sadly lose some guards. So we'll rehire those. And we'll check out... Yep. Make sure those are staff only. This is minsec only. So is that. Those are set up fine. And this one then. Max sec. And staff only. So we now have all that set up. Good. Working. Progress. Phew. It's been a tough uh, couple of <laughs> in-game days, that's for sure. So we've managed to fix... All of the damage that that fire caused, I'm, I'm going to guess that that was because I didn't give them that free time there, which is, you know, our choice, but there you are. Over to Regime, then, you can see that Maximum Security has work slash free time. I'm going to change the Maximum Security to have even more lockup, and what I'll do is I will lock them up there and there and have free time, work slash free time at the end of it. So they still have work free time. Um, either side. Actually, it's only just four hours, and then literally that, like six hours of lockup or work. Fair enough. We'll keep the rest of it the same. These should be. We'll have to change these now. Deployment. Custom. Medium and max. All of those. Actually, no. Medium for these two. And the yard they'll have access to. Let's double check our grading then. Max sec grading 34. Medium sec 124. Soup max. We don't have what's minus 5 if we did. 177 for that. Good start. They don't have access to any chairs. Or pool tables or anything like that. Um, Maybe I'll give them access to common room. No. We'll... Keep it like that for now and see how we get on. Over to transfer, we can see it says total motivated to qualify 12 and one is qualified now. So the prove all, there you go. And eight prisoners are tra waiting to transfer, wanting to transfer from to MedSec. So that's really good. We have out of, well, we have 12 inmates in high risk and half of those are wanting to transfer down and are actively pursuing that goal. That's really good. After, yeah, that's that's exactly what we wanted. Right, good, happy. Anyway, let's go ahead and we will build our high risk cell block. So cell block, uh, sorry, cell, um, our solitary over here. Now this is going to be a bit different because I want it to be probably quite large. So I'll say hmm, cross there and that. And the same on the other side. But I really want more in the middle as well. Can we have more solitary in the middle? Is the question. Well, I think we can. There'll be something like this. 
and it will be just the, the smallest ones you can imagine really um shame about that one at the back there <laughs> it is what it is and then in the middle we could have that i don't know does that work then you should have entrance on one side uh, not really working for me that one not really doing anything i'll tell you what I'll just build the building first, and then we'll we'll worry about the rest of it later on. So, doors, large jail door, sorry, standard jail door, red. We'll go there. I could use remote doors for them as well. And two prisoners are unable to be assigned to a cell. Who? Hmm, I don't know who. Ah, it's probably because we don't have the solitary available. Could be. Go to informants. Potential CI. L. Redhand. Apparently the duck. I have no idea. Uh, let's go to... Oh. Experience and recruit an informant. There we go. Recruit the informant. So you can see there's a lot of traits around there. Extremely quick, volatile, stalker, instigator, a couple of unknown traits. Same thing down here. We might obviously hear about those traits. At least this is all functioning as well, so that's fine. That is fine. Anyway, letting the workers crack on with building. They've got a lot to build. Um, in terms of the grading, like I say, for the... Max sec, it's on 34. So they've got yard access, they've got two meals a day, and they have medium yard and canteen quality. Whereas all these, you can see, is grade zero. <laughs> That's fine. Two unable to be assigned to a cell, I don't know who that would be. I'm guessing it's people that we've moved down that not uh, they're unable to be assigned to a particular cell, but eh, it matters not really. They'll uh, it'll sort itself out. Anyway, this is our new area for solitary. I'm just thinking actually, maybe we can do it another way. No, we couldn't do it that way. You know what? We could just have long ones like that and just do that all the way down. <laughs> And not even have a bed. This is what we used to do previously in the game. And it does fit in. I'll, I'll put a toilet at the end. And that's it. And it's just basically a cupboard. Well, okay. Mm, I think we'll do that. I think we will do that. So, wall max sec. Go along here. And there we go. Oh, out of cash of all things. Fair enough. Um, we will get ourselves a 25 grand bank loan because we have more than enough opportunities to pay that back in the future. So as I said, this is solitary. We'll put a toilet in the back. And that'll be it. The There's no one patrolling there. I'm tempted to hire an armed guard. To go in there. For the time being though. We'll just set up a blue patrol. Like so. And assign a guard to it. There we go. Okay. So we'll let them crack on there. Lots to build. I'll run some electricity in there. We'll also run some pipe work down too. Small pipe... Oh, on the left and right. Followed by the toilets that will go in there. Looks like there's ample lighting. It's actually one of the few times when it is. And it has legitimately went in the right place. There we go. We'll say solitary. Designate all of that. Designate all of that. And the doors, which will use these door secure. And I think, I 
don't know which side that little lip needs to go on. I think it's the outside. I think it is. But it doesn't matter if it's the wrong way around. Aesthetically, it makes a difference, but mechanically, it does not. There we go. There's that in. 15 grand on secure doors. Let's do a shakedown. All sectors. Getting close to a thousand places to search here. Still, a couple of prisoners unable to be escorted to a cell. Three unable to be assigned to a cell, actually. Interesting. How many prisons do we have? Uh, enough. Medium security, 47, and our capacity is 44. Okay. And that's a tunnel. Yeah, we found a tunnel. Let's remove that one. Remove them tunnels there. So, why is that set up to be like that? They're medium sec, as it should be. They're all low. That's high. Max sec. Hmm. I'm not too sure. Okay, we are going to treat some people here. We'll check transfers. We'll review the transfers. No one to be moved down. What I'm going to do is we'll do a lottery. We'll go around here. We need to have three prisoners. Oh no, only one now, apparently. Days without incident, one. Anyone's got a good number of days without an incident. I'm going to move them down to low risk. Five days without incident. Ed, it's your lucky day. Minimum security. There you go. Uh, we still need one more. Four days without incident. Another red. Minimum. There we go. And minimum security 40, minimum capacity 49. And the rest is set. They just might not be they might not be able to be assigned to certain ones because of the grading of the cells. Sorted itself out now. Okay. So solitary is getting sorted here. There's no automatic door open on there, and quite frankly, I said I wasn't gonna build one, but I'm gonna put one on there, and I'm gonna put one on there, because it's becoming a little bit problematic. It shouldn't take long to build. But we also need some flooring in here. Flooring, we've got, well, just the standard kind of carpet in there. This one is the bed and this, like, same one we've got on the right-hand side. So I think this one, I'm very tempted to have, like, something really horrible. Grass and stones, running track. No, there's nothing I can really have, sadly. I just have to have this then. This metal. So you've got <laughs> landscape. Make it water. No, um, <laughs> we've got this horrible wall which I was tempted to use, but you no, know, it seems to be a bit over the top. Let's get that sorted. So connections, door control system, one and two. There's all that connected up. And still shaking down the prison. It's taken until tonight to shake it down. I'm guessing that most of the stuff that we found will have been stolen. F yeah, look at that. Look at all the stuff being thrown in. And loads of stuff being nicked here as well. Wow. That's loads of stuff being stolen. But that is... Uh, access to everybody, but I can't change the sector. I'm gonna, I'm, well, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to change it to low risk. And when we will this one, change it to high. There's some si sub there's some subsidence. Let me stop that shake down, which has broken the outer part of the wall. Let's fix that there. Okay, so I'm going to change this. To staff only. I don't know what purpose it's really serving other than to fling people in here. <laughs> so, we've done that. We now have 
20 grand coming in. Don't know how. Not going to question it. Exports. All right, so they're selling loads of stuff here. With us changing this to low risk only, it's probably going to it's going to massively hit the amount of people that can work there. So we need to build this other one. The problem with that is if we got to quick build and cloning, it's going to cost us 47 grand. That's funds that we don't have. Okay, I think we'll leave it there. Next episode, we will continue on, and I want to build... Basically, I want to build this. I want to build the rest of it. It's... Um, I don't think it's unreasonable that we can do that. So we will have to see if that is possible. Either way, we will leave it there. Bit of a dramatic entrance at the start with all the fire and such, but we sorted that out, fixed the problem, fixed the problem with these working, and we now have very close in view of that. We now have a decent amount of prisoners. Uh, no prisoners are arriving now. Uh, I could say fill capacity. I could say intake. Sort of medium sec. Fill capacity. Do we really want to bring more people in? Uh, I don't see why not for today. So 10 minimum security prisoners. Alright, so we will leave it there. Next episode, we will continue on. At minimum, I want to build this workshop and forestry and a couple of these. But hopefully, we'll be able to get it finished off. But we'll see how we get on. As always, if you have enjoyed the video on the series thus far, comment in the comments. Thanks very much for watching. Take care. And there's no fire at the end of this episode, so that's good. <laughs>